going to pursue this. I'm going to pursue every single legal means that is available to me. First is the contempt of Parliament, which I'm going to push and raise very hard. Because right? I believe Facebook are in contempt of the Australian Parliament by their conduct. Second is defamation. Third is breach of contract. Fourth is misuse of market power. And there, and I'm going to use every single resource at my power. I know it's a David and Goliath struggle, but I've got some people that are prepared to back me uh, financially on this because the legal system, unfortunately, uh, uh, is even for a member of parliament, is, is, is beyond the, uh, the uh, even a member of parliament to be able to access because of the cost, especially when you're up with someone with basically unlimited pockets, such as one of the world's largest corporations, such as Facebook. But I'm going to do everything I can to hold them to account because we cannot have this censorship in the debate going forward. Every single thing that we have in society today, every single progress that has been made is because someone said, well, hang on, there's a better way or there's, that, that's not right, there's a better way of doing it. There's been someone saying something is wrong, that's the way we're doing something is not right and argued against what was the consensus opinion. We've got to be able to do that. We've got to be able to stand up and debate things in a free society. And even if those ideas are wrong, they shouldn't be silenced. Remember the great uh, quote of John Stuart Mill, he says, yeah, even if the idea is wrong, it gives you a greater insight of the truth. If you hear that wrong idea, and it just may be right also. So this is, this is uh, one of the great concerns. You know, we, we can't have these foreign multinationals suppressing freedom of speech on political matters, especially here in this country. Uh, the other option we've seen laws, we've seen places like Florida and Texas introduce laws like that. I'm going to be working on legislation like that to introduce to the Australian Parliament. So we need to fight back as hard as we possibly can. It's simply not acceptable that a company like Facebook or, or Twitter can obtain all this market power and all this advantage and all this wealth and price, all, all the great, you know, good luck to them for the money that they've made. But you can't do that based on the back of a system that's been created and wealth that's been created by allowing free speech and then get to that position and then decide, no, we're going to stamp down it and censor it. We've got to fight back against this because I think this is one of the greatest threats that we have to our democracy going forward. Mm -hmm.